My grandfather Ballard uh, died when I was not yet 11. Unfortunately, in those early years of my life, my parents were not active in the church. And the, one of the great sadnesses of my life today is that I never heard him speak, I never heard him sing. I never went to the tabernacle to a general conference. His last sermon that he ever delivered was here in Boston. And uh, I have a copy of it with me. It's the last trip he made during last his life. Trip, hmm? Last trip. I knew that the people loved him when I went to the funeral. The tabernacle was jammed and the assembly hall was jammed and there were, <clears throat> there were hundreds in the uh, Temple Square grounds paying tribute to a man that they, the church really beloved. And I've often thought, if I had known that this was gonna happen to me, this matter of coming along many years later and moving about in his footsteps, uh, I would have wanted to know more about what it meant to be an apostle. It's been tender for me to be here and know that this was, uh, was his last stand as a disciple of Jesus Christ. He was so devoted to the Lord Jesus Christ and gave himself so completely in the service of the Master. So I feel obligated to do everything I can to declare and to teach that the gospel is once again on the earth.